Well, greetings, humble boys, girls, and of course, gifted animals. How are you today? I'm doing well. I uh, appreciate you asking. Um, of course, this is your humblest and dearest, uh, relatively casual uh, and mild, spicy sometimes, uncle. Along with me is uh, the wonderful Mrs. Uh, Carl, um, aka Spicy Carlita. Yes, yes, your spiciest of ants, Spicy Carlita, back at it again, ready for another taste. So what are we doing tonight? Well, we noticed that Arby's had a couple of boneless wing flavors uh, when we were transversing mm -mm -mm. east of the Mississippi. And you all know how much I love Arby's, so. Do they? Uh, after the, uh, rib sandwich from the Arby's, I think I made a pretty big exclamation. But if you don't know, your spiciest aunt, uh, thinks the finest meats come from Arby's. They do have them. They do um, have them. We're drinking Old Forester tonight, which is a really good tried and true. If you get a bigger bottle of it, it's a good, uh, great value bourbon. A little bit more expensive, obviously, than, uh, your Evan Williams, which, uh, we do like to drink here on the uh, Spice Carl family of networks, but this is a very good bourbon for $35, so. Mm. What are the notes? Cheers. Um, it's smooth, uh, that's what I like about it. It's not as bold as say, a lot of other bourbons that are aged longer. Any smoke? Of course, you know, a little bit, but not too much. <laughs> Back to the food. Um, they have two flavors, so they come in a $5 or a $6 meal deal. The $6 variant has nine pieces of boneless chicken, and then the $5 one has six. Now, you might think that, you know... Well, that's for the meal. With the meal. Now, okay. that comes with fries. Yes. Uh, with both of those. Now, the $5 one is a less, uh, you know, advantageous buy, uh, but the $6 one's a pretty good deal, honestly. Um, but they also sell it a la carte. And which we, which we accidentally did. We did, did accidentally. We, didn't we did want not some, get the crinkle cut fries. We did want the crinkle cut fries. But we were in it for the wings anyway, so it's, mission accomplished. So $3.49 for this. It's uh, We got the six piece. Um, so we could get two flavors. So there's a hot honey. That's kind of what it looks like. Are you sure that one's the hot honey? I think. Uh, and then this one is the buffalo. I am pretty positive oh, about yeah. this Oh, yeah. Let me get it with. Usually you can smell a like a honey. Mm. Yeah, and this is certainly buffalo. Oh yeah. Oh, that's the same buffalo that they put on their um, buffalo chicken slider. So I bet that's gonna be really good. Okay, so we're gonna try them both and we'll give uh, separate opinions. Um, mm. Oh, mind? there's two forks. Okay, all right. Look at that, Arby coming in. So yeah, this, these are, we had to wait a little bit. I'll use this one. Oh, thank you. We have to wait Probably a little got bit. Hair and hair on it. That is true. I don't know where she is. Um, I got it again. <laughs> so the 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 interesting thing about this is we have to wait a little bit, but they're super hot. Um, it was a five minute wait, so I'm really excited because you know what that means. But everything else is perfect. Uh, Crispy. You know, they gave us utensils, two of them, at that, and they also gave us some napkins, receipts in the bag, all good. Couldn't um, be better so far. Except for the wait. Well, I mean, I don't mind waiting at this hour. I'm gonna dig into the buffalo first. All right, we can do that. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Cheers. Cheers. Good quality, it seems like. Yeah, it's just chicken nuggets. Yeah. I do like the buffalo mm. sauce. It's not a nugget though. No, it's not like your preformed rib meat chicken patty fake pink slime nugget. It's your, mm. it's the Arby nugget, which is just a chicken tender cut in half. Oh, do they have nuggets? You're right. These are the nuggets with sauce on them. That's all but it is. I had a critique of the nuggets originally that they weren't true nuggets. They were just miniature tenders. So. Say miniature him? Miniature? Wow. What do you want? What do you want from me? Hmm? I don't know. I pronounce it miniature. Hmm. Interesting. I like the enunciation. Um, the buffalo sauce is really good. I don't know if you've had the sliders, but they're 
it's quite good. So we're good on that. Um, you can't have this to wash your palate, but. I know, it's honestly a little bit spicier than um, <clears throat> I anticipated. But we're gonna have. Um, the we're hot gonna... honey. Hot yeah. honey. Now, I don't think this is on the slider at all. No, no, this is it's a completely new. new. It's uh, got a good little coat of sauce on it. Cheers. Yeah. Smells great. It smells like a buffalo wild wing sauce. Mm. Not too spicy. Smokier than you think. I wish I had tried that one first because I think I have um, it's tainted. leftover heat from the buffalo. Because I can't tell how spicy that is. Do you want some water? That tastes like um, barbecue chicken to me. Do you want some water? Yeah, I'm going to have to do a rinse. Hold on. Appreciate it. If the boys on set actually uh, had prepared better, you know, might be in a different predicament. But, you know, with employment shortages these days, we're all doing the best that we can. So we appreciate you back home staying patient with us. Carl? Yeah. How's, uh, oh, and we actually have our spiciest of pups here. Thank you. Unfortunately, we can't hire any good union boys. We're in a whole bit right now with, you know, collective bargaining and whatnot. They take every dollar you get. Okay, I've cleansed a little bit. May I? Yeah. Oh. can't find good help these days. Oh, okay. A little bit different than what I had the first time. That's a good sauce. Um, so what are your thoughts? Let's start with buffalo. Um, buffalo is exactly what I'd expect. It, I feel like I'm cheated a little bit because they already pulled out their nuggets and these are the exact same thing. I agree. Nothing and special at all. The buffalo sauce you can already get on the slider. So, I don't know. I feel a little gypped as if it wasn't a real new item. But yeah. I like it. It's all right. Yeah, it's okay. I mean, overall, I'd probably rate it like a 5.2789. It's not crispy enough. That's the problem. Yeah, I think those are a little bit older than the other ones, actually. Hmm. Yeah, I think you're right. Yeah. Excuse me. So the five minute wait now becomes a little bit more questionable. That is true. Regardless, Maybe these had, were out first. Yep. And then they had to make these ones fresh. I bet. Mm. We see you Arby's and uh, yeah, you know. It is what it is. That's fine. Understood. True. It's a tough time. Okay. We're moving on. Hot honey. I really thought those were uh, really good. I think it's smokier than you think. It's uh, got a slight sweetness, but not too sweet at all. It's not like a very sweet honey-like barbecue. And I'm not a big honey barbecue fan. Uh, Spice Carlita is. Um, I like that this isn't as sweet, but it's got a hint of it. Um, and it's got a little bit of a kick at the end. A little bit of a, you know, kind of a, almost a cayenne you know, type of paprika type of like light spice to it. It's not spicy per se, but it certainly leaves a little tingle on your mouth more or less. And uh, I'm very impressed with the sauce. I think the sauce really sells it here. Chicken's really fresh on this uh, variety here. Um, so I have to rate the, the hot honey uh, fairly highly. Uh, and I would say that's uh, easily, um, you know, 6.8 to mm. 774. Yeah. You? Yeah, I mean, it's slightly above average for me. I'm going to rate the hot honey again. Well, I'm going to rate it a 7.6 flat. Because why the heck not? But again, I feel like I've been misled. Hot honey. I'm, I must not have looked at the picture. But I was expecting something not quite so dark. Not quite so barbecue-like. Like when someone says hot honey sauce, I don't think barbecue, but this tastes like a variation of barbecue. And, yeah. uh, I just feel a little bit 
I just dropped some. Mm. Uh, hmm. I feel a little bit misled, but nonetheless, I think these are great. A little bit above average. I would get them again. The Buffalo. Yeah, it kind of makes you want more, like wanting for more, not make you want to order more. Did you read that? I, don't, I didn't. I guess it's just um, like a 5.4. Yeah, eight, eight. eight. Surprisingly, we are on the same page here tonight. Uh, <laughs> a rarity. And uh, this one should go down the books. Uh, we're within a couple of significant digits again, which is nice. So Absolutely. Anyway, uh, any passing thoughts as uh, we say goodbye to the folks? No. Okay. No. Stay classy. And... Uh... Like San Diego? <laughs> <laughs> get the chicken if you want to try it but you might be slightly disappointed or just averagely satisfied so anyway uh this is us reporting on your blue collar dollar um and you know god bless hope to see you again and uh, as always you take care stay tuned until next time i anticipated that time but that's all right